All right, so this is, this is the explanation of why we use the Trinity with clean slate, zero in, and restore. Let's fill that out as I get rid of my chalk. So many, many people talk about their, their body being a house. Your, <clears throat> your basis is very good. I look at more of it as, as an apartment complex, you know, as a, as a condo tower versus an individual home. But with Christina's book, Cure the Causes, she talks about you, your body being a city. So, and you're the mayor, right? So all the decision-making that goes into that city comes through you. Um, but when you look at it from a health perspective, it's really, really important to understand that everything's broken into segments. So when you look at the systems of the body, you have the immune system, you have your neurological systems, you have your psychological systems, you have your nervous system, your cardiovascular system, endocrine, reproductive, circulatory, and lymphatic system. And we think of them as being all different, but they're all connected. And part of science today that brings all this together and these are upside down, if you're judging me, is the gut-brain connection, right? And going back and forth. And then in addition to that, when we look at our psyche, you have the physical components and of your environment, you have the spiritual components, your mental and your emotional. So you put all of this together and you say, okay, how do you tie all of this together? Well, one, to have disruption in any of this, it actually starts in one place. It all starts there. Mercury, cadmium, arsenic, lead, aluminum, cesium, strontium, gadolinium, other radioactive isotopes, the rest of the heavy metals, the toxic heavy metals, glyphosate, PBEs, PBDEs, PCBs, all these different fire retardants, chemicals, pollutants, barium, stuff that's in the air, stuff that's in the water, stuff that's in the soil, stuff that's in your food, stuff that's in your breast milk, stuff that's in your mom that when you were conceived was put into you, creates all of this. And the worst part is, is if we just look at one of this and we say this one, and if you don't remember the periodic table, it's mercury. And why is that bad? Because mercury is the worst neurotoxin known to man. It is the second most deadly chemical known that is not a radioactive isotope. Number one is dioxin. If you, most people know that if you're exposed to dioxin, this just in, you're gonna die. Mercury is number two, but the hard part is, is mer we've been exposed to mercury for millennia. It's been horrible. And it destroys, this is the worst part, Mercury is known to damage and inhibit proper function in every system of the body. But what's unique is the disruption that it does in every system of the body is different in every individual. So we all have that as an issue but how that issue expresses itself, how it shows in us, in this, in this, and in that is all different. So how do you address it? The first thing of the Trinity is clean slate. To remove all the toxins, you gotta get the bad stuff out. <clears throat> And zero in is important because it's the most amazing capsule of happiness ever created. But zero in helps your gut produce dopamine and serotonin. So this gets to the conversation here. The gut-brain connection that you hear so much about. What's the problem in your gut? You're toxic. What's the problem in your brain? You're toxic. What's the problem from these components in your brain? Well, 
Neurotransmission is one of the biggest issues. You're depressed. Okay, great. Dopamine and serotonin. You don't have enough energy. You can't work throughout the day. You don't sleep well. Dopamine and serotonin. What's the biggest issue? They're produced in your gut, which is toxic. You're stressed out, which means your body's not gonna produce those neurotransmitters. So how do you fix it? Well, you gotta clean up the mess, right? So we've got clean slate. And then second, you gotta add in the good stuff. You gotta feed your gut the ability to start to repair itself, but also give it that specific recipe that allows your gut to produce dopamine and serotonin. Again, as it sees fit, and as it desires, because our body is very adaptogenic, right? We adapt to our environment. And if you provide the right tools, the right nutrients, compounds and such, amino acids and a few different things, you allow your body to start producing dopamine and serotonin as your intention sees fit. It is the most amazing capsule you will ever try over time and I, I will promise you, if you use it for even a few days, it will provide you experiences that you've never dreamed of. So you have the two and then to finish it off, you have Restore. And why is Restore important? Well, if you have damage to all of these areas, specifically your gut, you have to re store your gut. They talk about the, the tight junctions. Your gut is supposed to be kind of like this, but with toxicity issues, those tight junctions loosen up a little bit so things can get through. So what happens with that? Allergies, other health issues, bad stuff gets through there that's not supposed to, so you can have inflammation issues, you can go down the list. And the, the thing that gets me so often is people saying that inflammation is the cause of disease. This just in, that's a lie. Inflammation is not the cause of disease because here's the really simple question. If inflammation was the cause of disease, what's the cause of inflammation? What? Do you know what the primary cause of negative inflammation is in the body? That, you're toxic. It's the etiology. So you get to go back to the roots of the problem because if you address this and you remove the mercury, the other heavy metals, the other environmental toxins from the system slowly, passively, and systemically, right? Because we're working with all of the systems. What happens is you start to create balance. The body, when fed properly with good stuff, is then able to regenerate, restore itself, and start to be amazing. Not just good, but freaking amazing by choice. That's the approach. That's why we call it the Trinity, because it can bring people back and feel amazing.